Hello again. Um, today we're going to do another little show and tell. Um, I'm going to be showing my lip products and maybe doing a declutter as well. I am obviously not going to swatch all of them because that would take forever, but I will swatch probably a few of my favorites. So if that is something that interests you, then keep on watching. Cue the intro. All right, welcome back. Um, like I said before, we're going to be doing a uh, little, another little show and tell of my lip products. Um, I know that compared to some, I don't have a lot, and compared to others, I probably do have a lot. Um, I keep them either in here this little um what do you want to call it like a little drawer thing that I got from Sephora like this is other stuff but this big one right here is lip products and then I also have um this lip vault thing from that I got from Wet n Wild and let me just show you that one first I don't have all of them still because I have gifted some that I know I wasn't going to wear and then let me show you what that looks like and if you will notice there's some that are obviously they're missing and then these ones right here are turned upside down because these are actually duplicates because before I purchased this I actually um, purchased uh, wet and wild well lipsticks on their own because they're I don't mind them the, I'm wearing wet and wild on my lips today um, they kind of smell a little weird they taste a little weird too but they're they're reasonably priced they're creamy and I think they look for the price they look pretty good all right so let me just start getting some of those out I'm not going to show you all of them but like they range in color from light pink like this let me swatch that one for you and I generally don't wear this light pink on its own um, if I wear a pink like this it I wear it with a darker um, lip liner so that it looks a little bit not quite so not skin like but like the like same color as my lips now of course we're dealing with uh, my poor eyesight so this one's called a short affair all right and the ones that I um, have duplicates of is this one right here this one is called breeze B R S E it's another like light pink this one is more of a this one's more of a pinky. This is more of like a peachy brownie color. So, and then my absolute favorite is this one right here. And this is a red color. It is called Just Garnet. And it reminds me of the first MAC lipstick I ever got. It almost, it's not quite the same shade, but it's pretty similar. It could be a pretty similar dupe, I would say. And I don't remember the, the name of the MAC lipstick. Is that, I had that a long, long time ago. Okay, and then, like, the darkest shades is one like this. And this is, what's this one called? This one's called Black Orchid. And this I would probably wear if I was wearing, like, a nude... I would probably wouldn't wear a bold lip and a bold eye together. All right, so like I said, I'm not going to show you all of them. I'm just going to show you a few. Okay, let's open this up so you can kind of see. Let's see here. Those are the rest of them. And some of them are lipsticks. Some of them are, um, some of them are lip glosses. This is like a um, a metal one. This is one I just showed 
um, in my haul video, and I'm not the hugest fan of this one. So this is probably going to be one that I'm going to declutter. And then, let's see, we have another dark one that I got from BoxyCharm, maybe? Or Ipsy? I don't know. This is an old one, so this is probably another one I'm going to declutter, even though I like the color. I can, I have one that's similar. So, and then I have some lip glosses that I got, like, from Ulta. Let's see, just a random to hold up a bunch of them. A random assortment of products. So I have like the gloss from Fenty Beauty. I have a lip oil that's that's it's not really doesn't have really have a, a tint to it. I usually use that over one over a lip stick. Um, I have this one from what brand is this? Wet n Wild. Another one from Ulta. I have a bunch of these. They're the Jeffree Star. I think they, it's a Morphe collab that he did. Yeah. Um, and I got these from Ulta, I think, quite a while ago when they were on sale. And of course, I'm dropping things. But yeah, so I have a huge assortment. I'm going to start like going through ones I know I wanted to clutter. So this one, I know I don't like. It's too drying. I'm going to put the ones I'm going to keep. Just I'll obviously definitely going to keep that. This I got recently. It's from NARS. It's the birthday one. I do like that one. This one, even though it's um, it's tiny, I do like the way this looks. Um, especially like over uh, a lipstick. So I'm keeping that one. This one I love. I really wish that Marc Jacobs was still doing makeup because this is probably one of my favorite um, lip glosses. It's kind of, I think it's plumping because it, it feels tingly, but it, it's not like ones that hurt because I definitely have had ones that hurt before. Okay, this one from Jeffree Star, I think I'm going to declutter. This one I don't really like either. What on earth is that shadow in the, this is a shadow in the background. This one I'm keeping from Fenty. Um, let's see here. This is another lip oil, I think. I guess it's a rollerball lip gloss, and I don't really use it, so I'm gonna declutter that one. Keeping this one from Jeffree Star. Try to get these quick here. This is actually another one of my favorites, and it's a very cheap one. It is not cheap, affordable. It's from LA Colors, but I love this color. If I could find this, I need to see if I can find this in another brand that's similar to this because this doesn't last very long when you put it on, but I absolutely love the color. Okay, this I'm going to declutter. I don't really use that. don't use that one either, and I don't like the way it smells and tastes. This I don't really use either. It's another from Cab, and the Doe Foot applicator is humongous. And it's very sticky and gloopy. Yep. Definitely not one. I don't like the way it smells either. It smells funky. Okay. This one I just got from Sephora. Don't like it. Um, good thing they were cheap. This one I do like. This gloss. Um, this one I've actually never even tried. So I'm going to keep it just to try it out. I have another one of these. Because, again, it's my favorite. Um, this I'm going to get rid of. This I like. It's from, what is it from? Stay Glossy. From Rimmel? It's from Rimmel. Okay. Um, this I don't really like the color of. I might keep it in like, wear it with something else, but I'm, this is kind of an on the fence one. Um, this one I don't really like. Again, this one from Sugar, don't really like. So I'm getting rid of quite a few of them, actually. All right. Let's, I'm keeping all the ones for Wet n Wild because I've already gotten rid of the ones that I I don't want. I'm keeping this one, keeping this one. Probably decluttering these two from Jeffree Star. And this lip oil from um, Ulta. I don't need all these lip oils. Okay, hold on. Let's separate the ones we're keeping from the ones we're... Okay, we have a few left. 
Another lip oil I'm going to get rid of. This one I kind of like. This one I like. It's from NYX. And this one I like too. This is the one I got from uh, the Walmart Beauty Box. And I had done a review on the products from that, but um, the file was corrupted when I tried to save it to my phone. And so, like, I, I, I had recorded it and I tried to edit it. And when I, when I saved the edited version, it was corrupt. So I had to scrap it. So there's just a few swatches. I don't usually do pinks. I do mostly, um, well, I'm wearing pink today, obviously. Um, I do mostly reds, nude, brownish, pinkish colors, but actual like bubblegum pink or um, light pinks, I don't think they look good on me for some reason. So, yeah. So, I'm going to put these back in here. I'm just going to pull them up. them there willy-nilly. I'm not going to like... Sorry, I'm trying to see then, whoops. well we'll figure that out later and then if you look we've definitely decluttered a few of them which is good so I still have at least 20-30 lip products here and then the ones that are in here so I still have a lot all right so I think that I'm gonna end it here um, I do have some other videos coming I do need to do um, part two of my story time uh, from me leaving the Mormon church uh, hopefully BoxyCharm will be here soon I doubt it it's early in the month so it probably won't be here um, for probably another week or two uh, but cross fingers crossed it comes soon um, please subscribe thumbs up this video and uh, comment down below what you thought of this video you know I haven't really been growing as a channel very much so if you are watching this and you've stayed around this long let me know like what it is you think I'm doing wrong like am I doing something wrong or am I just too boring am I not too hoo, 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 happy go lucky person like I've, I've seen people that are like that and I could fake that I suppose but that's not my personality I mean I know a lot of people change their personality for YouTube but that's just not me I'm not a you know happy go I mean I'm, I'm not like a Debbie Downer but I'm more of like midline I sometimes show you know a lot of emotion but mostly I'm just just me you know that's just who I am Anyway, I ramble way too much as usual. So I'm going to say goodbye for now.